guys. I'm really excited to announce that Coco Daisy asked me to be a guest designer for January 2020. And of course I said yes because I really do love their products. I think they're so cute. I first became a fan of Coco Daisy when I went to go wild. I actually had not heard of them. I went to go wild and I sat at a Coco Daisy table. So I have used a couple of things of theirs in the past that I got um, while I was at that table like freebies and I really really like their stuff. It's very cute and the it all coordinates. It's um, their, their website has a subscription service so you can subscribe to get a kit every month or I think you can just go on and purchase kits as well. But um, they sent me a whole bunch of stuff and before I start planning I'm going to show you what they sent me. So this is their, all the stuff is from their kit called Noted and like they sent me this cute little look how cute that is you guys um they sent me like so much stuff and i cannot wait to use it throughout this month and create lots of different stuff with it so i'm just going to show you some of the things they sent like look at these look at this washi tape it has like pens on it and stuff i love this theme of a kit I'm so glad I got this one because look, <coughs> excuse me, because look at these little die cuts. I mean, how cute is this? It has like, look at this, little pencils and pens and look, a clock, like plants, all sorts of little cute things that I am actually in love with. Like, I can't stand it. It's so cute. I can't even stand it. Look at this little camera oh my goodness and you guys know I love paper airplanes right this is like perfect for me so they sent some stamps which I am terrible at will probably not use but I might and then these little cards look look at the glasses look oh my gosh Look at this. So lots of little ephemera and little die cuts and stickers and things. Um, little cards. These are, look at these stickers, you guys. Look at these. The detail on them is so cute. Little notebooks. I love it. I'm not just saying that. And this cute little to-do list thing with the plant. More little die cuts. Look how cute these are. Oh my goodness, look a pencil sharpener. This is the kind of stuff when I was a kid, I would have loved this stuff. I mean, I love it now, but when I was a kid, I would have gone crazy for all this mini stuff. Look at this, I didn't even see this before. <gasps> I think these are sticky notes. Look at that, look how cute that is. Little habit trackers, a clip. Look at this clip, I mean, Oh, so cute. So then they sent me, hold on, let me just move some things out of the way. Then they sent me a bunch of bigger stuff, like these cards, look. And sticker sheets. Like the color palette is so pretty. They have little cleaning, I'm gonna use these trash ones. They have little cleaning stickers. Um, and then they have more little sticker sheets here. This is like the little Coco Daisy mascots, I guess you could call them. This is so pretty. And these are like little washi strips. More like just the the um, the artist is really really good. I I mean the I just love it so much. I know I've just said that a hundred times, but. More sticker sheets. Look at look at these little clips. I love this. I'm probably gonna use this today. Maybe not this one, but there's another one that's smaller. I could totally cut these out and put them in there, right? It's always a good day to have a good day. Tell memories. Your memories tell your story. I could cut those out. Like, there's so much I could do with this. So during the month, you're going to see me use this stuff a lot because as a guest designer I am look at this as a guest designer I am required to post 
you know, quite a bit. So I will be using these things throughout the month. Look at these. And, um, and so, yeah, so if you like this, check them out and also stay tuned for seeing me use this stuff. So let me get rid of some, like some of that. it's, it's all over the place. There's so much of it. And I love this bag. I am totally going to use this bag for pens or something. That is so, so, so cute. All right. So now I have to figure out what I'm going to do with it. I didn't get that far. All I did was put, start this video and showed you all the cool stuff that I got. And I really did not get as far as what am I going to do with it. So let's figure that out together. I really do think I'm going to use this because this is the first week of the year and what better way to market than to do this. Now this is my, um, my like, like wellness journal that I use. So I am going to be, um, writing like my moods in here and stuff. So it's not a normal week. So if you're new to my channel, my, anytime I use my classic planner, it's going to be for that. So. I think what I'm going to do, I think I'm going to cut this probably. I hate to cut it because it's so pretty, but like I need to cut it. So let's start by cutting this down a little bit and then put this in here. And I think, I think I'm going to use maybe those highlighters, maybe the highlighter stickers that had the days of the week. Let me see. I did not, I'm sorry, I'm sorry in advance if I start to bore you. I did not prepare well enough for this because what I usually do with my videos, if you regularly watch them, you'll know that I start out with like just one little idea and I just then go along from there and I do it, like I figure things out along with you. But I have so much of this stuff that I probably should have pre-planned. <laughs> I should have pre-planned because I can't even find, oh my gosh, I can't even find the stickers that I was just talking about. Now that I'm looking at these, I don't know if they really match this. I was going to use these guys and kind of put them maybe at the top of the page. I thought that would be really cute, but I don't think that's really going to, I don't think that's going to like go with what I have in mind. So I'm going to put these aside. I'm going to cut this and I think I'm going to maybe, maybe measure it out. Let's see. I feel like I'm going to put it up here. Maybe, maybe over here since this is like the 30th and 31st and this is January, but it's going to come like, it's going to cover this section at the top here. So let me go ahead and mark it. So I know where to cut and then we'll see if it fits. All right, I'm definitely gonna save these parts of the card to use somewhere else, maybe even in this same spread. So whenever you cut something down, like save those parts, do not throw them away. And then you can use them in like another part of the spread to kind of make it all coordinate together. I think that's really important. Now I made this a little bit big because I was afraid that if I made it too small, I wouldn't be able to then make it bigger, obviously. So I'm going to cut it down a little bit more. Bumble is barking up a storm. Bumble's like out there, happy new year. Today is, I'm filming this on New Year's Eve. I know I'm late this, I'm late for this, um, the spread because I should have been doing it before the 30th. Uh, I'm late, I'll, I'll be honest with you, I am late, but that's okay because it's a mood spread. It's not like a, a weekly spread. I already did my big spread, so. All right, so let me, take this and I'm gonna stick it down in my planner but before I do that let me just why do I always say that before I do that you're like just do it Mary Ellen um I want to use some washi and I, I 
I kind of want to use some of the washi that they sent me because it's super cute and like these really go. So does this. Let's figure out what we're going to use here. So a little rule of happy, it says. That is the truth. I love me some washi tape. I definitely love me some Coco Daisy washi tape. Theirs is some of the best that I have had. So let's go ahead and open this and let's just see what it looks like on the page. Oh my gosh, Bumble won't shut up. I'm gonna have to call her inside in a minute. When I wanna call her inside, all I have to do is knock on the window and she comes running in. In fact, I'm gonna show you guys that right now. So listen, listen, and you'll hear her run in when I knock on the window. Hi, baby. <laughs> Hi, and now she's running in the living room looking for somebody. She thinks someone else is here, but I always knock, she comes running in, and then she gets a treat. So hang on, gotta go give her a treat. Okay, so she got her treat. Now she's happy. Okay, let's take a look at this washi tape and just see what this one looks like. Oh my goodness. Look at the little pens and pencils. <sighs> so cute. That is so cute. I don't know though if it's gonna match this enough for me. Well, I guess it will. I'm gonna bring in some other colors. So where am I gonna put this? Should I put it at the bottom of the page? I feel like I want to do that, put it at like the very bottom. So let's, I don't like this right here as much, so I'm gonna bring this one over. And let's just put it right at the bottom. I hope this video is not too long, but it might be because I am definitely new to using like other kinds of products in my planner. Like I'm gonna be using also some Erin Condren stuff coming up and stuff like that. And I'm honestly just so used to planning with the Happy Planner products that when I plan with other products, I'm gonna take a little bit longer probably be in the beginning because I have to get used to it. This is a different kind of planning than what I'm used to, that's all. And that's good because it's like making me grow. Maybe I cut it off here. I don't know, let's leave it there for now. All right, so now, sorry I'm opening these with you guys here, but now let's see about these because I feel like it's going to like really match that color there. So that might be a good thing. So I hope you guys have some fun plans for New Year's. I'm actually staying home this year, which I'm not sad about. I thought I'd be sad about it. Um, Cause I really just didn't have any, like all my friends had like other plans with their spouses and stuff. So I really didn't have any too many options. You know what I mean? But I am actually really okay with it. I'm excited. I'm going to make myself a fancy dinner and I'm gonna stay at home and I'm gonna relax and have a glass of wine and listen to my dog bark at the fireworks later on because that's what she does. All right, so let's, let's take, um, oh my goodness, Bumble, stop. Let's take some yellow washi here. No, you are not going out there. Nope. No, 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 no. No whining. Bumble. You're ruining my video. Come on, baby. No, you can't. No, because you're going to bark. And nobody wants, the neighbors don't want to hear it. Neither do my subscribers, by the way. Just saying. Okay. So I could, I could maybe bring this down a little bit. What do I want to do? I feel like I want to put it here. 
instead of bringing it up to the top. So that's just a little bit of washi there. I'm gonna keep going even though my dog's a pain in the butt. Do you wanna sit in my lap? You wanna sit in my lap? Maybe I do like a pink here and then it turns into yellow. I don't know why. Kinda of cool, right? I like that, it's like a pink leopard print. It's pretty wild. All right, so far so good. Um, I don't know if I should just keep those peach lines in here or if I should maybe bring in some green like in that pencil there. Let's see. I need a new way to store these skinny washi tapes, you guys. It, it's, it's overflowing now. I need a little, I know exactly the color I'm looking for. It is, I actually know the washi tape. Oh, here it is. Here's the washi tape I'm looking for. Is this a good one? I feel like that's pretty good. Okay. So now I'm going to take this. It's almost out. It's one of my favorite ones, I guess. I've used this one a lot, actually, now that I look at it. I'm just going to take that and put it across these lines. I feel like washi tape like used to be more popular than it is now and people are kind of shying away from it now. Not me, man. Not me. I love my washi and I don't see that stopping anytime soon. Like I'm not going to cover like I'm not going to do like big boxes around the page or anything, but I just love the look of it. So, yeah, I'm going to keep using it because why not? I like it. So up here, I don't know what to do, though. Maybe I'll use like a pink. Hmm. Or light blue, even bring in that light blue that's down there. Let's see, do I have a light blue? I think I'm suspiciously, I don't have that many light blues. I do have this one and this probably will work. It's a little more teal though than the light blue in these things. So let me see. I think the only other light blue one I have is like either glittery or clouds. And I really don't want either one of those. There's that one, I don't want that. So I'm going to go with this one and I know it's not going to be a perfect match, but hopefully it will be good enough and you might not notice. Let's put that at the top of the page. It's looking really, really cute so far. So let's see what else. I think I'm going to bring in some boxes and I am going to combine some Happy Planner stuff in here. So. Let's look in this colorful boxes book. That's colorful boxes four. And I may want to bring in like, what kind of color would I want? Maybe some of these green boxes. Let me look in the rainbow book, the big rainbow, the mega pack see what I can come up with in there. There are some light blues in here. But that's like too small because these are going to be my like for my feelings like little journaling things and I just think that's too small. So Bring this one in. Oh my gosh, everything's falling. I'm just gonna put that out of frame, but please know I'm pulling these stickers from that mega pack. I just, I'm not gonna be able to show you because I've got too many things around my desk right now. Somebody was funny in one of my last videos and they're like, 
uh, I look behind you and like, how is your room always so nice and neat? And I was like, what are you talking about my room? Cause, um, yeah, that is not, it's not always nice and neat. Basically what I do is if I've got stuff on like over there, I, I take, um, maybe I'll use this. I take everything that's over there that the camera will show and I move it to the other side of the room. So if you saw my desk, you would know that my room is not always neat. Trust me on that, it is not. So it just goes to show that uh, people who look at social media and everybody looks, you know, everything looks perfect and people get a certain idea about people on social media. But in reality, it's not like they think. So all those YouTubers you're watching that have like the really pretty rooms and all of that, I guarantee you they've got crap on the other side of the room that they're not showing on the camera because nobody's that perfect. Honestly, they're not. So don't even think that. Don't feel bad about your own life because they've got their own problems too and they've got their own messes and all of that so yeah I can't find too many boxes here so I'm struggling a little bit I need some yellow and yellow boxes are really hard to find I am gonna pull in one of these little guys um, I'll put it down here All right, so we've got some boxes down. I might bring in more boxes, but for right now, I'm gonna leave it like this. Okay, so now let's look at some of these cute little things I got from Coco Daisy, because I wanna bring in some of these adorable, adorable, adorable little stickers. And I'm gonna pull one of these cameras off, because how cute is this? Oh my goodness so so cute I'm gonna put it right here on the first oh my gosh love that okay and notebooks put one over here I feel like I'm in like like sixth grade right now fifth grade how like tickled I am by all this stuff I know it's weird Maybe I'll put in a little habit tracker. Hmm. I don't know. Let me wait on that. How about a little stapler? Oh my gosh. Oh, a little stapler. Let me see. Um, I'm going to take my glue pen and glue this in. here okay it's looking it's so cute now what else I really like that little clock I don't know why I'd put it there but I like it I'm gonna hold it there for a minute and see how I feel Notebook. Oh my goodness. How about that? Yes, that's where I'll write notes. And oh my gosh. All right. Shut up, Mary Ellen. <laughs> you guys are like, all right, already. We know it's cute. We know. Cut it out. All right. 
I think because I like mini things. I don't know if I told you guys this before. I think a lot of people do, but I love mini things. Um, I'm obsessed with mini things. I don't know what it is, but little mini anything makes me so happy. We have this board game called, like, I think it's called Dice Capades. We played it um, a few days ago. And there's these mini dice. They are literally like this big. And it comes in a bag of like 40 of them or something. And you roll a bunch at once. And it's like these tiny little... Oh my gosh. I'm in love with the little dice. So. How about that there? Maybe I will make this a little generic so when I write in it. So that I can post an after the pen. I feel like I want to do that, so I'm going to try to do that. Um, what else? Maybe, let's see, I think that might be enough of like the little things, but what if I take a pen, and you know how sometimes I'll write around the boxes? Why don't I do that, but I'll do that in like pastel colors so that it just looks delicate and pretty and just adds a little something else to the boxes. Yes. Um, so I guess mild liners probably is the way to go for this and the need to kind of test the colors out. So that one's good, I think. So why don't I, this is like a risk right now, but I just draw. Ooh, I don't know if I like this. I don't know if I like it. That's kind of cool. I don't know. I'm I'm concerned. All right. Um. There is. What other pens do I have here? I don't have a lot of pastel pens. That's the thing. This green's pretty good. Oh, I really went wonky there, but I'm not gonna stress about it, guys. I am not because my word of the year is peace. I'm not gonna worry about it. This pink is too bright. So let's get a Crayola Super Tip, which is gonna be a little softer, and we'll use that instead. So. Let's use it up here on the yellow, I mean on the green circle. I don't, I know you're probably wondering why I'm not going all the way. I'm not sure either, <laughs> but I wanna like maybe put, should I put something on the end of those to kind of, what about like an arrow? That's weird. try it it's kind of cool I have no no reason for that other than I like arrows so why not draw some arrows don't be afraid to do weird shit in your planner you can quote me on that all right why not all right what else what else guys um, do I think it's done? Maybe. Do I feel like it needs a little bit more? Maybe. Um, no, I don't want to bring in any black, although there is that black up there, or brown, I should say. Hmm. Maybe I do. I kind of don't mind it right there. Right, I'm going to put them there. And I think I am going to leave the washi tape all the way across the page. It really doesn't bother me that much. So I'll leave it like that. All right, let's put that down there. I think that's good. I think that's good for the before the pen. And let's see what I do with it when I write in it. I love this. I hope you guys like it too. Let me know in the comments down below what you think. 
and stay tuned for Doodle of the Day. And also check out my videos this month for more Coco Daisy stuff to see what else I come up with. I will talk to you guys soon. Have a wonderful day. See you next time. Bye.